In today's video, I took the role of being a judge and taking whatever civil cases the players have. From a couple of 212 calling Obi-Wan their daddy, to big time Rush almost being banned forever from the server. This video definitely had some chaotic moments in it, so stay tuned. But if you want to join the server to partake in events like this and join our server, you can find a link to the Frostbite Gaming's Discord in the description. This video is also brought to you by Nexus Core Hosting, the same host that powers Frostbite Gaming and Synergy. If you play Minecraft, Gary's Mod, or Arma 3, and have thought about making a server for you and your friends to play on, or if you've considered starting your own community in those three games, Nexus Core is the host for you. With a new, improved, simple to use interface, a quick support team ready to help you out and get your server up and running, lightning fast server performance, low latency, and so much more, Nexus Core is the host to go with. You can save 25% off your first purchase by using my link down in the description or using code PIXELCAT at checkout. Now let's get into the court of law. All people in the court, can I have your attention? Please rise for the honorable Judge Gorlax. Am I gonna die walking through here? In the court of Republic law, it is final decision, Judge Gorlax. <laughs> Hello, I am the Honorable Judge Gorilax. Today we will be taking your civil cases. If things do not go your way and you need an emotional support animal, we have an emotional support Bantha right over here. Now we will be taking as many cases as we need to today. So to get started, if you have a case that you want to dispute, go ahead and put T in OOC chat. And the first person to do that, we'll just, uh, we'll call you on up. We got Mihawk. All right, Mr. Mihawk, please come up, introduce yourself. Tell us a little bit about yourself and what you're doing here today. Go ahead and get in one of the pews. In one of the uh, pews. <laughs> go in, in one of the pews. This one over here, sir. Oh yeah, get get going that one. Hello, Your Honor. Uh, my name is Mita Hawk. I'm a Jedi Padawan in the Jedi Order. Uh, I'm here today to bring a lawsuit against the Bad Batch because they threw my young, sickly cousin into the sewage plant and murdered him brutally. Oh my! Is this the man right here? Uh, I believe he's actually the leader of Bad Batch. Yes, Your sir. Honor. Is he the one that was responsible for throwing your what was it your your child in or what what was it what what happened again? My young cousin, Your Honor. What I have seen and camera footage he was the one who did it personally all right uh mr bad batch can i get can i can you introduce yourself give us your name of course honorable uh, judge you know before i like to introduce myself you're looking uh you're looking great today my name's Thank hunter it's nice to meet everyone. Is that it? <laughs> <laughs> seem like a nice and outstanding gentleman so uh what do you have to say of what he is accusing you of did you do it yeah <laughs> i see I mean, okay. Okay. <laughs> Let me. I was amazed, okay? it, it all began with the uh, the uh, infection outbreak. I don't know why we let a twelve year old kid on a military base, but you know, you do you. But your reaction um, was to throw it into a sewage plant. Tell me about that. Might I add, I I was I was ordered by uh, a couple of people, the leader of MC RSB and Ahsoka Tano. I don't think she's here today. Uh, tried to treat the the, the child. And she actually blew up the tumor and made just smaller tumors in the child's <laughs> lung. So he had, he had a shorter lifespan So the child was already expected. struggling. All right, let's hear what Mr. Yeah. Jedi has to say. Your, Your Honor, I do want to start with the fact that my young cousin, uh, he did have stage four lung cancer when he arrived. They did attempt to fix it from what I was told. They were going to send him home so he can be with his family and when he dies. But uh, unfortunately, the reason why we're here and that, that situation has happened. How, how long do you think your cousin had to live? If you had to guess. For the incident with Ahsoka, I would probably give him another year or two. After the fact, uh, I would have probably given him about another three months. What are you seeking in damages? I I'm seeking uh, 50,000 galactic credits for distress and the emotional damage it has done to uh, my family and also funeral costs. All right, what do you have to say about that, Mr. Bad Batch? Before this incident uh, transpired, the, t the, the child was told to sit in the waiting room, but he obviously didn't listen. He assaulted my... My, uh, my colleague across here multiple times by biting him. He ran around pressing a lot of buttons around the base, you know, disrupting military activities. It was all around a shit disturber. So what was a child doing on a military base to begin with? Uh, I, I think I think Mihawk may have invited him for some strange reason. I thought he, he thought it was a good idea to bring it to medical corps. Why, what was your cousin doing on the base to begin with? I, I'm not too sure, sir. I did not invite him, but I believe because I was residing at this base i can also emotionally support him while he's going through that all right this is a pretty tricky one i think i've heard enough from both sides and now i'm gonna leave it up 
to the audience. I'm going to put a poll out. And based on this poll, we will decide who is going to be paying whom. I like to take this time to uh, thank our sponsor, uh, <laughs> Galacticos. Sweet and sugary. Make your teeth rot. Thank you. I love Galacticos. The Jedi guy or the Bad Batch guy? Now go ahead and vote and uh, tell me who you think should win this case. Judge, may I add something? Yeah, absolutely. You could turn the ties before this... this Oh, closes. Uh, why does why does a, a Jedi have a family member? If I remember, your Jedi code strictly states Boo. you don't have any family attachments. <laughs> Boo! It was, it was not my it was my sibling's Boo. child. Can yeah, you drown the child? What do you mean? <laughs> <laughs> the Jedi guy is one. So. Quiet. All right, the poll has passed, and the Jedi guy wins. And so we will be making the Bad Batch gentleman be paying 50,000 galactic schmeckles to the Jedi man. He gave me 500 credits. He's lying. He's lying, Judge. I, I gave him 50,000. He's lying. He gave me, you he gave me Please do a check. Do a check. He's trying to get out paying child support again. <laughs> Just, I don't know, check his pockets or something. Go ahead and fish around in his pockets and make sure the money's there. We, we're being told you only gave 500, sir. And I, I did stay, I had 115,000 with this. Do what you guys think is uh, a good response to this. Jail, death, I, have uh, fun with it, have fun. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> you didn't get your money, Mr. Jedi, but if you need an emotional support animal, uh, we do have a bantha over here. If you need a little bit of therapy. All right, let's get on to the next case. The first person to put a Q in OOC chat will be the person that we pull up. We've got Jar Jar Drinks. Sir, we got Jar 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 Drinks. I was supposed to do that part. Approach the... Oh, sorry. Oh, I, I didn't know your job. All right, yeah, go ahead. Go ahead and do the announcing. Go do the <laughs> Jar Jar Drinks, please step up for the honorable uh, Jar uh, Judge Gorlax. I was actually supposed to be the one to pick the next court case, but okay. Oh, you were... Oh, but my, I didn't know. Um, we never, ever discussed that. You, you did. You did. Oh, well, yeah. I forgot. I'm sorry. This is a really stressful job. I'd be in front of all these people and judging them all day. I was supposed to just pick the court case and then you handle it from there. Ask him what his case is. Ask him what his case is. Oh, you want me to go that far? Okay, okay. Oh, wait, is that my all job? All right, Mr. Mr. Jar. Yeah, that's Jar. Jar. <laughs> Mr. Jar Jar. Oh, what, oh, what are you doing here today? I like the CURC medical for shoving holocrons up my butt <laughs> and turning me into a bug. I see. RC, well, come with me. we can pull up two people. I mean, suing the entirety of RC and medical would be kind of difficult. Do you have two people out in the audience that we should pull up? I'm going to hey take the, the pew because squeeze I'll be leaving in. it very quickly. So please introduce yourselves and kind of describe a little bit better what, what it is you're doing here today. My name is Jar Jar Drinks. I'm a Jedi Padawan, the Padawan of Master Umbra back over there, trying to get compensation for, for the mental damages they done to me. All right, uh, let's hear from the other side. Go ahead and introduce your guys selves and uh, tell us what you think. I'm Second Lieutenant Eric from Medical, Head of Science and Research as well as Development, Skirata. Omega-22. All right, keeping it simple. So what do you guys think? Did you do it? This pertains to a confidential case that is sealed by the Galactic Republic itself. The person in question here actually did sign off on a confidentiality agreement, therefore abstaining from bringing this up in the court of public. We have that in written documentation, and not only that, we were able to successfully cure him. And I would also like to absolve medical of all responsibility as it was RC who put the holocron in his buttocks, therefore transforming him into an insectoid. I see, I see. And what do you have to say to this Jar Jar Drinks? Only thing that was sealed was the checkup. The RC thing was before, and the medical hurt me with a spike. Did I or did I not cure you? I still feel bug-like, and I'm still laying <laughs> eggs. <laughs> okay, but did I or did I not cure you? And was it RC that caused the transformation? And is it true that this should not be spoken out loud because it should be confidential? No, the confidential part is the checkup, which I can't say what happened there. But as a result of said checkup, see, you started oh, laying oh, you oh, and... <gasps> Okay, <laughs> that, there's an egg. Shock, can we can Sir, clean up, please? please can we clean, up? clean up those eggs? Yeah, get those eggs out of here. Not my babies. Oh, please don't, don't <laughs> make the babies. floor dirty. Not my babies. Get a janitor, get a janitor. They're was it or was babies. it not true that when you were an insectoid, you only trusted me, me to cure you and I successfully did so? Did you or did you not violently shove a big needle down my thorax? <laughs> 
Oh my. It, it was only necessary. We needed to do so in order to turn you back into your original form. You didn't ask for I would like to submit this. myself as I would like okay, I would like right. to submit order, myself order, as an order. expert. We need to get to the bottom of this and see who is wrong. <laughs> Mr. Uh, all right, still laying eggs in my courtroom. Uh, we'll can, allow it can, for now. Can you give handle so that, Mr. Please? Jar Jar Thank Binks, you. he is making the case that you are cured, but you are still laying eggs. So I, I don't know if saying that you're has cured he... is the correct answer. Yes, Mr. Eric, let's, let's hear what has, you have to say. Has he returned to medical for a checkup since, even though we advised him to do so, which was in the confidentiality agreement? Well, I feel like I would be a yes, little bit worried about getting checked up by <laughs> people that turned me into an insectoid that started laying eggs. But again, I can test that it was RC that turned him into it. Well, what do you, Mr. Mr. RC, mm. man, you are being pretty quiet throughout this case. What do you have to say on the behalf of RC? A lot of what I know is unknown at the moment as I was on orders to Coruscant do we by have Palpatine an RC himself. out there that would know more about this situation, or are you the only thing we have? Negative. We only and have a trainee honor, who I was, was also, trained today. I was in three places at the same time. We were examining the chieftain's wife after an off-map mission at that moment in time. This confidential experiment was uh, being undergone, and we were performing tryouts while doing patient checkups. I was forced to be in four places. He was under a confidentiality agreement and agreed to the treatment. I, I, I don't know what else to say. It's pretty clear cut when you have it on paper. <laughs> what the heck? I would say that there are certain people on this server that don't like paperwork, but maybe I should go bring you a stack of it. Oh my god, that, that's a big egg. Please show, show that straight to the look, camera. Look, look, yep. look, look. Get, a, get an HD view of that. Yep. Oh, 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 hang on, I gotta back up. This egg does not look normal. This egg is not normal. <laughs> oh my like, god. What is this? <laughs> so I, I take it your mental... Oh, one of my cameras got knocked down, son of a bitch. I, I will be using a camera. Just ignore the fact that this is in my hand. All right, I think we have enough information unless either side would like to give a, a a final statement but i think we're gonna go into the voting because this case seems too complicated any final statements before we go into the vote can i have my complimentary cyanide pill please yeah absolutely shock go ahead and give him his complimentary cyanide pill oh he found one <laughs> All right, let's get that vote going. Sir, he just laid a, a lot of eggs in the courtroom. Are we sure that this Gungan identifies as male and isn't biologically female? Oh, female Gungans can lay up to 1,000 eggs a day. The guy laying eggs or Eric? Stop throwing eggs at me. Oh, this one is going to be a lot closer than the other ones. <laughs> oh my God. Just Sorry. to let you know, the side angle does not work. Uh, I appear to be paralyzed. Yo, if you guys go medical, It's okay, I'll we have an emotional support, support so Bantha. Just, uh, just get close to that and you should be okay. I, I, I can't. Go away. The guy laying eggs has Third. won by a na just narrowly. We didn't even ask you, but what is it you are seeking in damages, Mr. Jar Jar? <laughs> Some compensation for my 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 horrible treatment. I need to get a, get a therapist. All right, I would say like 20,000 galactic credits. Does that sound fair to you? Oh, the Bantha went out and sees that yes, you're in major distress. Yes. Please make sure that Eric pays his 20,000 fine and uh, then we'll move on to the next person. I want to make sure that medical pays its dues. So I will not only give you 20,000, I will give you 50,000. All right, Jar Jar Drinks, the court is also deciding to give you a free support animal to keep. Wait, we're oh, giving him an animal? Where, where he did? I didn't, I I didn't know we were doing that. I don't want this thing anymore. I'm just giving it to him. I don't <laughs> okay, like this. All right. uh, Go ahead and proceed. Go take a seat. Come, come on. Come on. Take a seat. Take I a seat. Don't go to the bench. I'm going to add that. Go sit in a chair, buddy. Sure. Go to the bench. I'm gonna have to you, chair, buddy. you know what? I'll keep him with me. He almost got a free support animal. I'm not going to pick the next person. You figure out the system. Oh, Kerbo. This is the promotional support animal. You're going to give him. All right, go ahead and get the next person. Everybody. What the fuck is a Kerbo? All right, next person to say it. Oh, we'll see. Glass smells. 212 second lieutenant rat. Please stand up to the stand and address Mr. Judge Gorlax. Come on, Mr. Rat. Go ahead and approach that pew. We got the camera all fixed so we can see your beautiful face now. So go ahead and introduce yourself for oh, a second. Oh, thank you. And tell us, tell us a little bit why you're here today. Well, hi, I'm Second Lieutenant uh, Ultra Heavy Rat. Nice to meet you. You look well, darling. Uh, <laughs> I'm here today to sue my wife, uh, Dragon. Uh, she did not tell me that we had our daughter, and she <laughs> kept her hidden from me. I see. So I'm suing her for full custody. All right, well, let's go ahead and get your wife up on the stage. Let's see how the audience responds to her. Boo! <laughs> what a bitch. Boo! <laughs> 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 
bitch. Why All right, doesn't seem like the audience really cares for your, her too much. All right, Mr. Boo. Dragon Wife, uh, go ahead and introduce yourself. Tell us a little bit about yourself and what your thoughts are on why you're here today. I'm from 212 Ultra Heavy also. I am Rat's husband. I am here because apparently Rat did not know he had two kids. Our daughter and our sad we forgotten Wookiee who died over there somewhere in that corner. Very oh tragedy. He died horrible. And the son of a bitch died to sue me. How did Rat come to not know about his kids if he had two of them with you? And every time he comes home, I usually have the kids somewhere else. I'm not usually at home all the time. So I'm not sure when he's going to be home either. So our schedule is different. And that's why the child haven't met the father yet. All right, I think I caught like 75% of that. But what do you have to say in return, Mr. Rat? The least she could have done was to actually tell me that she existed, that my child existed. I didn't even know my child existed until a few weeks ago. See, what I'm confused about is, are you not both clone troopers so how exactly does that work have you seen each other without your helmets on we have multiple times in fact that answers that don't, question don't worry it's, it's more of a it's more of a medical question your honor it's more of a medical objection question. oh oh objection let's hear it i need to see both of these troopers with their helmets off immediately I, i'll allow it as a medical expert we need to examine their anatomy this cannot be the biological children of this trooper shock helmet off oh, pop off their helmets i would like to motion that if this were Imports indeed their child case. i will bring you into objection because Me. you're a kaminoan yes and you're cloning these troopers which would mean we have defective troopers on base which puts you I in direct violation of galactic suits. republic someone can easily just steal these suits and pretend that they're someone that i Oh! No question, you <laughs> judge. No. <laughs> Wait, that actually has any importance to the case. I, I do want their helmets on. The 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 right, we got Rat. Look at Rat. Nice mustache. You're rocking it, bro. And then we've got the wife. You're Ooh. rocking it too, baby. All right, hang on. The wife is getting her facial hair on. All right, there we go. Got a nice beard and mustache combo going. Holy f she's hot. All right. <laughs> One of you said that you have a Wookiee as a child. Can I hear some more about that? Yeah, we had a Wookiee as our child. But uh, sadly, he passed away. How? Actually, right here. Did he one was of you have he the was sitting Wookie beside gene? us. Like, how was the Wookiee conceived? Are you sure she didn't cheat on you? We are part Trandoshan for some reason. That's something medical did to us. But um, <laughs> but we we don't. <laughs> This is a tricky one. I really don't know what to think. Do you have anything else to say, Mrs. Miss the the wife? Like I told him about it when I went on a point and when he came back on the second day when the child was born. I'm like, oh hey, you have a kid. He's like, wait, what? I gotta go. And I just went out the door. Did you cheat on him with a Wookiee? No. The Wookiee is our child. He was bought he was sold on the slavery. Rat bought him just a few minutes ago and we just added him to the family. So you oh he was not, not biological. Oh man, that would have saved me no. a lot of questions earlier. Alright, I think we have enough information. Do any of you guys have any final thoughts you want to give before we put it to a vote? I still love my wife. I still love Rat. Well then, oh, maybe we don't even All have right, to uh, vote. Maybe you guys can make up right now. I think I got a good solution to this. What's Wait, your... there's our kid! Let me make a vote, sir. All right, yeah, go ahead and make a vote, but just re remember what brought you two together to begin with. All the love and the, the child making and the beards and mustaches. Look at each other. Don't look at me. Remember the good times. He's right. I miss you, Rat, so much. I think we're on the is without you, buddy. <laughs> oh, f I'm gonna cry out here. <laughs> <laughs> Don't cry, buddy. You're all you can cry. Yeah, thank you, it. emotional support Bantha, for going out there. Oh, yeah, there's the emotional support Kerbo. So the vote is out. Who <laughs> dies? <laughs> Kill, Kill both. them both and cringe. <laughs> That's wild. That guy's being horrorized. All right, Sean. Uh, you guys have your jobs. Go ahead and go ahead and get to it. Don't oh, forget oh, to the kill husband's leaving. The husband's, the husband's I'm running. Kerbo? <laughs> <laughs> yeah! Devin Hazel's turn. I yeah, just killed the Wookiee yeah. as well. Hold up, let me do this job. Oh, Kerbo! <laughs> Kerbo's dead. Anyway, let's move on to the next one. I'll leave it to a good old Frost. Yeah, thank you, thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. I love you. I love you 
two. All right, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. First one to say, I love democracy, can step on up. Democracy is a hard word. I don't even know if I could spell that. DT oh, Reverend, shit. spawn up. All right, Reverend, go ahead and approach. Introduce yourself and tell us what it is you're doing here today. Uh, good evening, everyone. My name is CT Reverend with a 2033. Those are my numbers. And I'm here due to the incident that took place last night with the uh, with the shock there was a group of us cts that were all vibing we were listening to our favorite band big time rush and we were fawning over their members like kendall schmidt and james maslow and the the shock they were ordered they would carry out an unethical action against us they beat us many of my they, my many of my friends that were beaten to death but uh, i i survived luckily so i can come here to to bring justice to the to these shoggies these criminals! Oh my, man, this sounds like very serious allegations. So is there any specific shock you would like to, to call to the stand? I want to go straight for the... Where is the Vice Commander Corsten? Oh, I do think he is here. Corsten, if you go ahead and approach the other pew, please. Oh, hello. Go ahead and introduce yourself and tell us your side of events. Who, me? Yeah, yeah, you. Well, I wasn't here. I was busy with another VIP, good sir. Are you sure this is the man you want to sue? Since he does seem kind of oblivious to the situation. And I didn't think that this guy, you know, I thought that he would have more context as to what his troopers are on the base. But, you know, fuck it. Let's go for Fett. Where's Fett at? Fett, you mother... Would you like Fett to go up as well? Is it just Fett? Just Fett. This guy just is Fett. clueless. This All right, Corsten, thank you for introducing yourself. I remember yourself. Fett. He was there. Go ahead and get back to your duties, oh, of course. I uh, guess. Your Honor, may I say something? Uh, wait, who said that? Oh, whoops, uh, ignore that. I was not on base last night during the time of the event. I am who the was but... here? <laughs> I think it was a wildfire. No, I was blaming that guy. I don't care here. anymore. Are you prepared to defend Shock from the big time rush allegations? Yeah, I got it. Go ahead and give him something to defend. Go ahead and go more into your story, Mr. Reverend. We were just enjoying our time. There was so many. Of the, it wasn't just CTs, but there were Jedi too. And there it was it was such a it was such a unifying moment. But uh, the higher ups ordered these these war criminals to come down and and destroy our friendship over big time rush. We were, we were there, we were talking about Carlos. Carlos Panavaga and his big chest. Is Carlos <laughs> Manavaga a member from big time he's, rush? He's one of the big time rush members. Okay, I, I'm not gonna lie to you. I don't know the first thing about big time rush. So now, now that Fett's kind That's of been fair. filled in on what he missed out on, Let's see if he can defend the shock from big time rush. So it seems like you guys were yelling constantly, which isn't allowed on base or blasting music. So whoever that officer was, was following direct orders to stop this kind of nonsense. This big time rush, if you will. Do you have anything to say to that, Reverend? Also, I'd like to add, I... it was also very late, oh. so people could have been in their bunks sleeping. Well, you know, this was taking place in the main hangar bay. We're having our congregation, the big time rush congregation. We we're having a great day. We, nobody came to bother us. Nobody was upset with it. You know, I'm sure those people had a great sleep listening to Logan's soothing voice. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, though. <laughs> The main hangar bay is kind of echoey, so it would go through the whole base. I think you're trying to distract from you and your brutality over my, my people and my, my fellow Big Time Rush fans, my, their supporters. This is going to be one that really comes down to the audience. Reverend, if I if I may, I think you're going to have to turn the opinion of everyone out in that crowd to be Big Time Rush supporters. Because if there's enough Big Time Rush haters out there you will probably be voted to lose this case. So for someone that doesn't know who Big Time Rush is, what it is that you have to say to try to convert us? Let me tell you, folks, let me tell you. Big Time Rush is the greatest pop band from the mid 2000s and mid 2010s. They were the, their greatest to this day, damn you. Kendall and, and James and Logan and Carlos, they are the <laughs> epitome of what it means to be a human being. And honestly, if you just take five attractive. milliseconds, I think you can agree with me that there was no reason for these monsters <laughs> to come down and put their brutality on me and my people. Your Honor, may I make a note real quick? Yes, proceed. I never said I wasn't a fan of Big Time Rush. All right, no reaction. Continue. I, 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 I'm in shock. 
All right, well, I, I, this case is going to come down to who likes Big Time Rush. So what do you have to say to the audience, Mr. Fett, to make people take your side? Well, you see, since it was late, people were sleeping. And that's it's not very nice to do that. As most of you know, I'm pretty nice shock. I'm nice to everyone. Treat everyone with respect. And Big Time Rush is pretty decent. I have one thing to say. I have one. I've made my points clear. I've made my argument concise and understandable for all those good men in the office. I have one thing to say. One final, Your final Honor. sentence. I Your love Honor, big I time have... rush. <laughs> Your Honor, I do have one objection. Yeah, let's hear it. When uh, Shock said that they could hear it from the main hangar bay, that is false. You want to know why? I cause disturbances all the time, yet no one complains about me. Well, with all of that information, I will let. Objection to the objection. Objection to the objection. Objection to the objection. Let's hear what Frost has to say. I was the one that introduced this man to Big Time Rush in the main hangar bay. You're, <laughs> you're false. <laughs> is this true? It is. I, I do believe that was the man who got us the MP4 players. Supreme Advisor Frost, if you could go ahead and make a poll to have everyone vote to see who is the winner, you can proceed. Remember what you're fighting for. Remember, this is your last chance you're to try to get votes, right guys. right to Big Time Rush. Keep, talk to the audience. Tell them your <laughs> reasons to vote for you remember remember what it means to go big time <laughs> I can't time say no. exist. listen to your heart it now is. listen how many times have i saved you guys from raiders big time big time quiet in the courtroom do we love big time rush we love big hey, time rush nah we're shocked God, yeah. free card. cuddle up with carlos oh, oh, you guys oh, have much more currently a tie. we need one oh. more vote oh 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 shock oh. is ahead by no, one vote no, currently no no well, no well, no shock, like shock is winning shock big time it's almost over big, big time. time was and shock yes. has won so please go with us. allegations he should pay shock fifty thousand republic credits Recount. That sounds Recount. reasonable. Recount. You can pay 50,000 credits or you can die tragically. Your pick. I will never lay down my love for Big Time Rush. <laughs> <laughs> they could have just stunned him and arrested him. They had to kill him. Let's get the next court case of going. Next foot I put in chat. I love Big Time Rush. Can step on Disgusting. up. Disgusting. <laughs> a gonk droid. I think we need a translator. I think we need a translator for them. <laughs> Yes, we absolutely. Is there anyone out there that could translate what this gonk droid is saying? Hey, is anybody here a translator? I can't gonk, explain your case, and then as soon as Frost gets back up here, we'll proceed. I am up here. Oh, hang on. Let me. Oh, there you are. Wait, why, why am I turned this way? I'm right. Uh, hi. Hi. Mr. 41st, have you had time to talk with the gonk droid to understand what is happening? Yeah, you know what? Probably good. We're probably good. Mr. Gonk droid, what is it you're doing here today? <laughs> Go ahead and translate that, Mr. 41st. Uh, you can't rush my job. I got to wait for him to finish. Uh -oh. Settle down. All right, I thought he was done. Don't on and keep the job. I don't tell you how to do your job, damn it. All right, everyone get this 41st some room so we can listen to the gonk droid. All right, quiet in <laughs> Let him do his job, <laughs> damn it. Keep your legs. All right, man, I'm just a translator. Uh, That's bad. That's dirty. We're going to get in trouble. <laughs> Disregarding the uh, the insults, uh, he says this whole thing has been a kangaroo court, and uh, the judge is okay. about as corrupt as they come. What? Is, I haven't even taken any of his cases. How is this a kangaroo court? Oh what the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> I'll allow it. Case I'll case allow it. Case All right, dismissed. let's get the next guy up here. Thank you, Mister Forty First. Well, we need to get the we need to get the next guy up here. <laughs> okay. Uh, I promise I won't kill them. I promise I won't kill them. No, I mean, their case is bad. Go ahead. You can kill them. You have my permission. I don't give a shit. I don't care about uh -oh. any of this. Uh -oh. Uh, they don't uh, hear me, so I it's like, okay, head. if I'm, like, I'm whispering up here. What, what What if they said something like, you know, like, they, they, they don't like, um, you know, they, they, they don't like, uh, ice cream? Am I allowed to kill them then? It's kind of messed up. It's not like the end of the world, though. Just look into my eyes. Okay, okay. All right, who's the next person? Got this. <laughs> whoa, 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 what are you doing? <laughs> he said he doesn't like ice cream. Nice try, nerd. <laughs> he said he doesn't like ice cream. I'm leaving his corpse. <laughs> All right, finding out who doesn't like ice cream is not getting the next person up here, okay? <laughs> listen up, listen up. Next round is coming up. First person to say ice cream in chat gets the carrot case. Get over here, Waffle. You're the only person to say ice cream correctly with proper grammar. Introduce yourself, Mr. Waffle, and uh, tell us what you're doing here today. My name is Waffle, and it's, it's, it's very nice to see you today, Honor. Uh, you're looking extravagantly bussing today. Oh, thank you. <laughs> 
Jeez. Oh my. Uh, oh I, my, my God, he has to be over it. My main call here today is, uh, I would like to sue the shock. Can you narrow it down, please? Everyone wants to sue an entire battalion, but can you please pick one specific person that you just you want to sue? Know who this guy is? Me, miny, mo. <laughs> what the? Who <laughs> if he holler? <laughs> Any, mini, money, mo I would like to sue Glass. The temporary shock trooper for the day. Welcome, Glass. Tell us a little bit about <coughs> yourself and why you think you shouldn't be sued. I'm not actually part of shock. <laughs> All right, go on. <laughs> You're fucked if you lose this. <laughs> Silence in the court. <laughs> oh my God. Go ahead and tell us why do you think this man should be sued? Well, he holds himself. You see, you see how smug he looks just standing over there with his arms crossed downwards, holding his gun out in the court, mind you. He is holding holding his gun out in the court at the at the pew. What do you need to hold your gun out at the pew for? Are you gonna are you gonna attack the judge? I did so feel a little true. bit threatened. So Thank true. you for having him put his gun away. All right, go ahead and explain yourself. Why'd you have your gun out? Um, there was my stun gun, sir. It would not have done any damage at all. It would just stun people. Objection! That looks like right, a real right, gun yeah, to let's me. let's hear it. Let me test it. it oh, like you... a... Assassination right here. He's trying to take me out on the spot. You're not being He's taken down yet. Me. Let's, everyone just calm down. Put the gun away. He, he said he wanted me to test it. All right, I, I will admit this man does seem extremely hostile. You haven't really done a whole lot, and he's just coming at you. Why, why are you like this? I'm saying, Judge. This is how I was made, sir. <laughs> How you were made. <laughs> oh, and then you're... Bro. That oh, is a disrespect. Can you please put your hands down by your sides? <sighs> a little disrespectful to be crossing them in court. I right, will allow that. Why do you think you shouldn't be sued? Like I said, sir, I'm a bodyguard for people. That doesn't really... I just I get mean, your for actions today have showed that you are an extremely rude person. I think you need to save your character here a little bit. I'm sorry, sir. Uh... What are the last three nice things you did? I gave money to the poor. I gave that bantha a bath. We <gasps> shit to people. <laughs> he f smells. <laughs> oh yeah, let me get a whiff of this bantha. <laughs> yeah, no, that bantha uh. is not clean. I have to agree with Frost here. You did lie about one of the nice things you did. It, it was a month ago, sir. A month ago. So out of the last three thing, nice things you did, one of them was over a month ago. Yes, sir. Man, all right. I mean, 41st, you can go on, but I think he's kind of proving your point here. And I would just like to point out, uh, when he said he was made this way, this is a that, that seems like a base foundation for uh, how they set up their shock, you know? Treat him with, with malice, you know, to treat other, other clones. To disgrace. I feel like we've heard enough from both sides. So if we want to get that vote going, Mr. Frost. Your Honor, may I say something real quick? Surprise witness, let's hear it. He is not actually in shock. Like he said, he is a bodyguard. He is not a full member of shock. What is he doing here today dressed in your armor, representing you? He stole it. Is this true? Yeah, there was Why a did he still have armor it? on a dead trooper. All right, Mr. Fett, if you could please go on the side with the 41st, because you will now be going against him as well. Get in the pew together. There should be enough room. Just squeeze in a little bit. So let's go ahead and get that vote going. Judge, judge, if, 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 if yes, I may. Sir. I mean, we're getting that vote started, so, so now's the time to defend yourself. If if he claims that he donates to the poor, and I am in fact poor, then, then wouldn't, wouldn't he be able to, to spare me a few coin, you know, like a few a few credits. Tell us more about you giving money to the poor. What happened last time you gave money to the poor? I give uh, ch to charities ten thousand a month. Let's hear these charities. The uh, Wookie Home Charity. All right, well the vote's already over. So uh, what what is it you're seeking in damages? <laughs> Are you seeking justice, money? Do you want him to give you something? I'm seeking money uh how much can i get to, to buy a popsicle from the so, nearest store can i can i say something really quickly yeah so? let's hear it. the vote's over That's but like two two credits if he takes my money then i can no longer give to the poor but he is the poor he already made that point did you just flip him that, off your honor, did, did you, you just flip your him honor? off <laughs> all right whatever I... <laughs> 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 all right, go ahead and <laughs> go ahead go the body and take all the money you want you have it all Where's that? So if I'm eating um a certain snack, first person to say uh, goldfish in chat, you to come up. Oh, I think he's eating goldfish. <laughs> Reverend, come on back. What the heck is this shark? This shark wasn't up here the last time I looked up here. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. I would like to press charges against Kai for trying to is do Kai surgery here? First and off my leg is Kai and sell here? He just killed himself. He just right. Stop him from dying and then get him in here. Yo, if he took a cyanide pill, doesn't that mean that it's actually RP death? Just say. I mean, we're in the future. We, yeah. can, we can prevent that, I think. Bad boy, stay in there, stay in there. Do not 
not leave unless I say so. Bad boy, bad. There we go. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. I know you look very sad. Keep in mind, we have an emotional support, Bantha, if, if you feel too distressed. Bantha, can you go out there? I'll comfort him for a second. <laughs> All right, he is being comforted. All right, so what is it you wanted to sue this man over? He keeps trying to cut my legs and arms off. I have multiple stab wounds in my leg from him. That wasn't me, he said. You have a rebuttal. I have security footage and the marks on my leg to prove it. What do you have to say, Mr. K -K -K Kai? It's Kai. <laughs> <laughs> I only took his liver and replaced it with a robot liver. Do we have any medics on that could confirm that he now has a robot liver? Also, what is a robot liver? Do robots need livers? I, I do not remember contoning this surgery or remember it happening. Your Honor, that was uh, Padawan Ahsoka, one of the other victims that he's harmed among me and Lat also. I've lost my arm, and I think Lat also lost his liver. And that was all at the hands of Mr. K -K He's one of them. Your Honor, yeah, I have also been experimented on by K -K -K -K. Who are the other gentlemen that are a part of K -K -K his group? That would be me. I have been experimented on by him. You're a part of his group, so you also have been experimenting on people and stealing no, no. their liver and replacing <laughs> it with robot livers. No, 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 no. No, I meant I've been experimented on by him. No correcting the judge. He's always yeah. right. Chez, <laughs> I'm always Chez right. was That's in the group. Right. Chez, Chez, Leon. On. Yes, your honor. Two of them. Are either King of them well. here? Can we get them up here? Because it, it seems like this man's not going to spill the beans. They tried to steal my butt cheeks on my first day. How did they even do that? Oh, he changed his name. <laughs> he changed his name. Like Can we have everybody in the front that's been harmed by medical up there the on the stand? Sir. Join me on All right, the stand. Mr. Kai, Mr. Kai, you never did that. All right, I guess we're going to need some of the proof. Do we have the security footage? I do. Yes. I have some I'll bring footage. It up to you I have as some well. footage. All right, yeah, let's see the security footage. Go ahead and roll, and then based on that, I'll make up what we see on the security footage. <laughs> you son of a bitch. I have my own footage to give you here. Oh, yes. Yeah, so, the more footage, the merrier. I have footage too, Your Honor. Right, yeah, let's, let's see it. Let's get all this footage out. Oh my god. Ooh. All right. Well, according to this footage, Mr. Kai, it does look appear that you are a little bit guilty. What do you have to say about this part of the security footage? That is clearly not me. Then why is it Bruh. at this part of the footage you're like, uh oh, yep, this is me. I'm Kai, and I'm about to do this. You see that part right there? I'm literally his twin. We're all twins here, but that does not excuse what it is that you were being accused of. At the end of the day, your peers are going to be the ones deciding your fate. Do you think you've made a good enough case for them to back you up? The judge is only twin as the other end of Q-tip. Quiet. Quiet in the f <laughs> you. I'm not a Q-tip. <laughs> I'm, I'm an alien. <laughs> I'm an alien, damn it. <laughs> Joke's on them. I'll just take their kidneys when they need checkups. Well, if uh, if you don't win this case, I don't think you'll be doing very many more checkups, Mr. Kai. Do you have any final words? And Mr. I forgot what your name is already. Mr. Other Guy, Shock Dude. You got anything Fat. else to say, Fat? I want, I want him to pay me 100,000 Republic credits and be court-martialed. Damn. That's, that's pretty extreme. That's quite a lot. That That is quiet a lot. So let's go ahead and get a poll going. It's you, Mr. Frosh guy. Are you done eating? Yeah, yes, sir, yes, sir, yes, sir. Goldfish. Yeah, yeah. Take the goldfish out of your mouth and get a poll. Yikes. How much By bread does he have in his mouth? Bantha, go out to the crowd and see if anyone's too distressed. Mm -hmm. Oh, God. Oh, please don't stinks. stun the Bantha. Yeah. Did please don't the stun bantha? the Bantha. You don't want to get your head kicked in by a Bantha. Yeah. <laughs> That was the sassiest Bantha noise I've ever heard. Oh, the epic cool shock dude or the ugly medic? You can change your votes. There's the not a whole wins. lot of time left, guys. Oh, guys, oh, shock's oh, lying. that was close. But the epic cool shock dude does win. So, Mr. Medic, if you could please hand over $100,000 and you will be court-martialed and you will have your genitals removed. Oh, he has a knife. He pulled out a knife. Ooh. All right, stop him, stop him. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> How about we get Q-Tip in the chat? Q-Tip. Yeah, Q-Tip, which is in no way related to me. Mr. Obi-Wan, step up. Go ahead and introduce yourself and tell us what you're doing here today. Hello there. Uh, I am oh, he said the thing. Jedi General General Kenobi. I am here because uh, two of my troopers in the 212, they keep calling me daddy and it is giving me emotional damage. 
heavily oh emotional damage. Are those it is, two clone it's, troopers it's, out there in the crowd very, right it's now? Very, it's very hard. Yes, it is both rat and dragon. Oh, the husband and wife, the dastardly duo. Uh, Hi, Dad. Welcome back. Welcome back, <laughs> Miss Dragon <laughs> and Mr. Hi, Daddy. Um. Okay. <laughs> let's let's order, order, <laughs> order. Oh. <no. laughs> Let's just chill out a little bit with that. All right, so why, why is it you guys are calling Mr. Obi-Wan Daddy? Your Honor, it's because we adore him and we respect him. We call him Daddy because we respect him. But don't you adore... He's also a high-ranking officer. If Palpatine were to walk into this courtroom right now, would you call him Daddy? He's a party dwarf. I would because he's always Daddy. Oh, your voice has changed quite a bit. Why do you sound like that now? I don't know. Mr. Obi-Wan, I didn't even realize the bantha was over there. Um, have you told them to stop? Have you engaged in them to maybe stop calling you daddy? Yes, multiple times, but they keep doing it. And it's hard for me because as a Jedi, I can't have children or form attachments. So anytime they call me that, I just get emotional and just it hurts. Well, aren't you it's... not supposed to be an emotional little baby as part of being a Jedi too? You can be sad. All right, all right, all right. When he tells you guys to stop, why, why is it you don't stop? Why do you keep going? Why do you call him daddy and papa? Because we just love him too much. We love him too but much. But if you really loved him, wouldn't you want to respect what he wants? Of course not. You see, we are the ones with power here because we can't have him say anything other than I love you. Uh, Obi-Wan, is there is there another name that they could call you maybe that would like, you know, chill it out a little bit that's not as aggressive as daddy? Why can't they just be normal and call me sir or something or general? Because that's that, those are my titles. How about Obi? 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 That's that's a step in the right direction, right? Oh, okay. Yes. Yes, Obi's fine. All right, but let's, let's see how this I've is going to play out. I've gone to therapy out. for multiple weeks because of this. You run into <laughs> Obi-1. How are you going to be addressing him? Hi, Obi. <laughs> Hi, Obi. Your Honor, Your Honor, I would like to mention to this court that Rat currently has a KOS on his head at the moment. Is Mr. Rat Excuse in this me, courtroom? Excuse, Excuse me, sir. Rat in this courtroom? He is right here. Oh. He's right here. Sorry, oh, oh, Obi's oh, orders. Wait, wait, wait. Yeah. No, 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 <laughs> Well, that's better run, save yourself. <laughs> Shoot that motherfucker! Seems like half of your problem is gone now, Mr. Obi-Wan. Hi, Obi. Dad, do you think you'll be able to put up with just this this individual by calling you Obi? I'm fine with that, but I still want them to pay for my therapy bills that I've been having to pay for the past few All weeks. All right, and how much, how much is that accumulated to? It's only been like 5K, but like as a Jedi, we, don't, right. get, we don't get I a apologize after paycheck. your honor. The threat has been neutralized. <laughs> thank you. Thank you so much for taking care of that. That helped a lot in this case too. We call you dad because we look up to you. You saved us multiple times on the battlefield. We saved your ass multiple times on the battlefield. Why can't you accept us as who we are, your they children, your instead? Ass multiple times on the battlefield, Mr. Obi. Is this true? It was only once on Geonosis. You say multiple times, and it's only happened once. How many times have I saved you, and you still call me daddy? I think we should put this one to the vote, because I am just so undecided. We got the vote coming, so if anyone has objections or any more comments to defend your side, let's hear it. I care about you, Obi. First, I love you. Uh, objection, objection. Uh, Dragon is masking his voice with a voice right button. What? Is this true, Dragon? Does my voice sound like a modulator? No, not at all. Really? No one's voting for us? Wow. I'm going oh, to wow. no literally smell this man in front of me. Well, Jesus or the weird 212. Who wins? I order to pay $10,000 to the Jedi. Yay, we can pay him money and child support. <laughs> Wait, do you, do you have the money? I don't. Bitch, I'm broke. This is the reason why we go to Nobi for money. Exit the stand now. All right, pay, up the, pay the Jedi. Hey, hey. Shock, stop those men. Yo, they didn't stop pay. They didn't men. pay. <laughs> so let's get one last question thing in the OOC. I have a f***ing case. Penis. The case of this bullshit <laughs> court. That's Whoa! my case. Shock, take care of that, man. Take care of that, man. Shock, don't let him say that. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Oh. <laughs> Bring that man back here. There's, there's, there's more than just me. We, there's a whole gaggle of mothers. We a love Ben Rush. We refuse these cases. I love Ben Rush. Oh my goodness. I love big time Rush. Active. What is upsetting oh, you, you so much, Mr. Reverend? I'm just upset because this whole court case, this whole session has been bullshit. What? what you is, know why? You have been judged by a group of your peers. What part of that is bullshit? I hear both sides. The peers have been rigged by the shock against the big time Rush fans. <laughs> There's barely any shock I know for the rest a of you. You're bringing back big time Rush. Uh, uh, no. Uh, uh.
<laughs> no, no, don't say Big Time Russia. Russia. If anyone sing Big Time Rush, arrest them immediately. No, I love Kendall. You can love Big Time Rush. I thought about getting Get some headphones so you could just listen to it in your free time to yourself. No, I must listen right. to Carlos through my MP3 player. Well, if you don't calm down, we're going to ban Big Time Rush throughout this entire base. You won. What's, what's, your, what's your case? Been, this entire case has been manipulated by higher government. And by, by the big wigs, <laughs> by the politicians. Who, who, who's who's pulling suing? strings? Who's Stay pulling strings name. according to you? Say a name. Jar Jar Drinks. Jar Jar Drinks approach the stage. He's been manipulating us. The f*** I do. <laughs> You're a little what shit. That's what you do, do, dude. Why are you accusing Mr. Jar Jar Drinks of all of this? This man showed up this morning. Oh, he's a new Jedi, right? The devil not sent by the senators. And then... And then and the, and the other senate, we, there's our government is only senators, so I'm blaming all those. You're kind of rambling a little bit. Do you have any actual things that you're bothered by involving Mr. Jar Jar Drinks? Yeah, he came. He came here to sway the the people. He's he's coming. He's controlling their minds with his mind tricks, and he's working with a shock to get rid of big time right, rush. All right, all right. Order, and I want order, this order, order, Reverend. Gone. Order, order, order. Let's 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 get the man a chance to reply. What do you have to say about all of this being put on you, Mr. Jar Jar? Play it now. Play it straight. What? Don't, don't look back. Don't hesitate. Wait, what? What? No more singing big time rush. Yes. Mr. Jar Jar Drinks, <laughs> what do you have to say of what you're being accused of? Because I'm, I'm not even sure what you're being accused of. Misa, all Misa does is meditate. All right, Reverend, go ahead and continue your rant. I can go on for hours. Yeah, let's hear it. Let's keep going. I'll tell you when to stop. The son of a bitch! <laughs> He says he meditates, but it's not. What the f is this? Why does it smell so bad? It hasn't been cleaned in a month, but it's an emotional support bantha. Oh. You seem a little aggressive. Just let it let it cheer you up. You, are you coming down? Uh, I, I do feel a little bit. I, yeah, I do feel a little bit. All right, now, nice. now let's hear your oh. arguments in a calm and nice and demeanor. Let's hear it. It's, I, I think it's well known among the big time rush community that is formed on this base that, you know, there have been outside sources trying to kind of get rid of uh, trying to get rid of our freedoms to big time rush all over the place. And, you know, I, I've had good reason to suspect that man across the stand has been sent here by the high, the higher powers <laughs> that control this empire, this uh, republic to get rid of big time from all of us. All right, um, Jar Jar Drinks, have you at any time tried to get Big Time Rush banned from this base? No, I actually, what I do is I put it in the Jedi bunks and we just jam out to it all night long. So what is it that makes you think that Jar Jar Drinks is the one pulling all the strings? What evidence do you have? My evidence, I, I've seen him. He, whenever you a clone trooper is going to the bathroom, he follows them in and then they come out. Do you have any witnesses? I've seen it with my eyes. It's in my mind. Uh, that's great. We you cannot can, see your eyes, Mr. 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 Reverend. I, go, I Mr. put Reverend. A, I put an Mr. Reverend, do you have any witnesses that we could bring up to back up your claims? Ask any one of these troopers that haven't had their minds wiped. Uh, is there by anyone this out there that has yeah. not had their minds wiped, as he put it? Sir, I have the man, helmet camera. Yeah. Get the man up here with the camera on his helmet. Okay, so this footage Bro. very clearly tells a different story, Mr. Jar Jar. This footage shows you going up to multiple troopers and spreading the hate of Big Time Rush. What do you have to say for yourself? I like to call a surprise witness, Umbra. You f traitor, Judas. Tell, tell them about tell them about the CDs I have in the bunks. I can confirm the first thing he did was like, hey man, you want to come look at my CD collection after I trained him from being a youngling? And he showed me and, uh, you know, he had like some K-pop and then he definitely, definitely loved that song. It was like his most replayed song. How can you, how can you know I how, can confirm. how long, how much someone has listened to a song through a CD? I have an objection. That's a good point. You can see the wear and tear on it. Yeah, the last point. Tear. I didn't think that through. As Sun Tzu once said, never interrupt your enemy when he's making a mistake. My enemies have made a mistake. The enemies of it, Big Time you just Rush interrupting have made them by saying I have something to say the second they were talking. I was, uh, and I'm going to say it. I'm <laughs> okay. saying it. I'm just saying you're kind of Those proving your own Those motherfuckers listen to K-pop. They said it themselves. 
They don't listen to Big, Big Time Rush as a pop band, not K-pop. You was that dead man. Oh my you God. Order, dead man. Order, order, I was just listening. Order. Mr. Jar Jar, do you have another witness that can't uh, just attest to your CD collection? Pretty much all the Jedi Order, but we don't have time for that. All right, in the entirety of the Jedi Order, please approach the pew. Yes, Umbra, you may come back up too, since I'm sure you're Give wondering. Give me your sabers. Oh Give me your God. sabers. Mr. Jedi, oh uh, multiple of you, what do you guys have to say? I think I think he has something wrong with his brain. I want to okay, object to that. He, he claims to have blasting BTR throughout the bunks in the hallways at night. Please use the full term. We are not going to call them BTR. Big time rush. You're talking about big sorry. time rush. <laughs> big time rush. <laughs> Give them right. respect on my man's name. <laughs> No, oh, no, there. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I meditate at night, and I for sure won't be able to meditate if he was blasting it, because I am a huge Big Time Rush fan, and I would be uh, dancing and singing along. He claims that he does it, but I've never once heard him play Big Time Rush. <laughs> All right, well, if you want to go on Objection. the side of Mr. Reverend, since you're obviously Objection. not with them. All right, let's hear it, Obi-Wan. Padawan does meditate during the night, but he failed to say that the meditation room is soundproof, so we can stay in deep meditation oh, the entire time. Oh, well, is that true? Is it soundproof? It that is true. true. Yes, it is true. If you're a big time Rush fan, just approach the pew. Logan and Kendall and James and Carlos come up here. Your honor. Holy May shit. I speak? <laughs> All right, there's a lot of you. I oh, oh, fucking oh. love big time Rush. If you guys can sing in harmony, a big time Rush song will let you off the hook. If you mess it up, the Jedi Ooh, exterminate so everybody. Yeah, if you mess it up, the Jedi have my full permission to handle this how they see fit. All right, boys, everybody pay attention to the vote. There's going to be clear instructions in the vote. Okay. Clear instructions in the vote. Yeah, in so the everyone vote? just scream at each other until the vote comes through. Let's go party. Oh. Big time Rush fans, <laughs> VTR fans sing if big we win. Big time Rush for Smelly life. Smelly Jar Jar you rushing KOS the judge. Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> Over the first you're ordered to stand oh, down for this. Oh, you're ordered to stand oh, down for this one. Kill the judge. <laughs> kill the judge. <laughs> Sean, you're ordered to stand down for this one. Get him! 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 In support of my soldiers out there, I'll be playing some inspiration. Oh my god.